We walk into a large room and find a seat in the audience area. We then view the presentation in front of us. We may laugh, we may cry, we may hear something that changes the way we think. We may hear something that is intended to change the way we think, but it doesn't have the effect desired by the presentation. Some of us have to get up in the middle of the uh, action and wade through the crowd of those seated near to us to go to the bathroom. When an unmuted cell phone goes into action, it disturbs those around the owner. Sometimes we come in late and have to excuse ourselves to those already seated. Some of us like to sit in the front while others prefer the back rows. At the end of the presentation, we get up, we leave the building, and we drive away and carry on the journey that is the rest of our day. We may or may not think about what we just sat through. It may or may not affect the way we live our lives from that point on. Now let me ask you, do these actions describe a trip to the movie theater, or do they represent a visit to the local worship service in your neighborhood? Do you ever find yourself walking out of church in the same way you do a movie, that you walk out the door, and while appreciating the experience, never give a second thought to what was presented? Moreover, do you find yourself walking into a worship service with the idea that the presentation is there for your entertainment, or do you walk in expecting a change in your life? Now, most of us would probably agree that there are few movies made today that convey any kind of life-changing, existence-altering message. But every Sunday morning, we gather in a place called church, where the intertwinement of our lives with the biblical text presents the possibility that bends and changes in direction can result. We may very well recollect certain scenes of movies and experience the emotion we felt at that moment. Recollection of our worship times provides the opportunity for us to spend time in prayer and thought. My prayer is that we prepare ourselves for worship. My prayer for all of us is that we ask God to prepare our hearts for the experience we take part in this weekend. I also pray that we look to the worship experience as something more than another stop along the entertainment walk of the week. Something to pray about, don't you think? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below, and thanks for watching.